All right, the fourth example. Obtain the first four terms of the function tan x about x being zero or at x equal to zero. We take it this way. The function is f of x equal to tan x. Remember, we want to obtain the Taylor series expansion for this function. But I would prefer to rewrite this function as sine x over cos x. Where we recall that the series expansion of sine about 0 gives x minus x cubed over 6 plus x5 over 120 then we have minus x7 over 5040 with other terms and the series expansion of cos x about 0 gives 1 minus x squared over 2 plus x4 over 24 minus x6 over 720 with other terms. All we need to do is to use this, which is cos x, to divide this. Because we are looking for the first four terms, you don't need to use every term. Of course, it's an infinite series, so you can limit the division with the first four terms, dividing the first four terms. So we'll be using the first four terms of cos x to divide the first four terms of sine x. This is the apple. Now, we have 1 minus x squared over 2 plus x4 over 24 minus x raised to the power 6 over 720 the long division we bring in x minus x raised to the power 3 over 6 plus x raised to the power 5 over 120 minus x raised to the power 7 over 5040 Let's go together. Remember, we have other terms here, but we shall not be considering those ones. We use 1 to divide x. 1 divide x gives x. So we use this x, which is the quotient here, to multiply these terms. x comes here, we give you x. x into this will give you negative x cubed over 2 x comes here we give you positive x raised to the power 5 over 24 x comes here we give you negative x raised to the power 7 over 720 so the normal way of dividing we subtract this would eliminate to give 0 when we work on this we will have 1 over 3 x raised to the power 3 when we work on this we have negative 1 over 30 x raised to the power 5 and when we work on this we will have positive 1 over 840 x raised to the power 7 this is just subtracting this subtracting this subtracting this because of the subtraction here we proceed we use 1 to divide 1 over 3 x cubed, that will give 1 over 3 x cubed. Such that if I use positive 1 over 3 x cubed to multiply these terms, we'll get this and this, which gives us 1 over 3 x cubed. This and this gives negative 1 over 6 x raised to power 5 you will agree with me that when this multiplies this you will have this are we together now so if this comes here we'll have positive x 
to the power 7 of 72 and this comes here we have negative x to the power 9 with 2160 we subtract again this will eliminate to give 0 and this when we simplify we will obtain 2 over 15 x raised to the power 5 this will give us negative 4 over 315 x raised to the power 7 this is the only time in x raised to the power 9 so negative will make it positive here x raised to the power 9 over 2160 we take the next division 1 will divide this to give positive 2 over 15 positive 2 over 15 x raised to the power 5 if this 2 over 15 x raised to the power 5 multiplies these terms this multiplying one will give us the same 2 over 15 x to the power 5 and if this multiplies this we will have negative 1 over 15 x raised to the power 7 and if this multiplies this we have negative 1 over that's positive now 1 over 180 x raised to the power 9 and if this multiplies this we have negative 1 over 5400 x raised to the power 11 we subtract again this will eliminate to give 0 this and this we give 17 over 315 x raised to the power 7 and I would want to discontinue with others since 1 would divide this to give us positive 17 over 315 x raised to the power 7 no need for this since I need the first 4 terms whatever you have here will not affect this so the first 4 terms of the expansion of tan x we have this we can write somewhere here f of x is equal to x plus 1 over 3 x to the power 3 plus 2 over 15 x to the power 5 plus 17 over 315 x raised to the power 7 with other terms this gives the first 4 terms of Taylor series expansion of tan x about zero.